the the second level of weapons isn't like too onerous, right? To no, you just, just it's like basically two iron. There's two iron ores for the next level. Yeah. Of the, the weapon that you're using right now, you just go up to a mineral thing and then mine it, and then you just two two iron ores. Yeah. Okay, so it's so don't worry about being stingy with materials. Yeah, you can just make whatever you want. Okay. Yeah, materials aren't too hard to come by. I made myself a baby set. Yeah. Ah, oh, here comes Jeremy with his max power! <laughs> Gonna one-shot your monster. Wait. Oh, look at it! It's not! It's not look at it! Did you see what I- Wait, what the hell are you? This is gonna hug us 105. What? <laughs> why is it so long? Uh, oh wait, why is yours so long? I don't know. What did you do, Ernie? <laughs> uh... Did you see that little like, mini-air hop I did too? Did you... Did you try to installing anything? No. Oh, I shouldn't... Well, I thought I got rid of that mod. <laughs> <laughs> or I thought I didn't even download that mod. How come yours is so long? The hop is nothing. Yeah, that's the uh, infinite reach claw. <laughs> I, I, I totally thought I didn't get that mod, huh? I didn't I need to get rid of it. Yeah, it's not I mean, problem. it doesn't really matter either. <laughs> but yeah, I'll, I'll let you know how to get rid of it. But it's kind of, it was for uh, the funsies, for the lols. <laughs> I totally thought I got rid of it. When I was testing it. it I oh, you killed the birds! Yeah, and the lot of damage. Oh, man. <laughs> Is it actually infinite reach? Yeah. Oh, I man. think so. Well, okay, wait. Uh, try, try going behind the rock and shooting at them. See if it goes through terrain. What oh. The? oh, my god. Oh, you better catch up to it with the claw. Oh, it doesn't go through terrain. terrain. Okay. I'm just looking for the north campsite. It's so docile. Yeah, most monsters are docile in world. Oh yeah, cat marks. Kestodon. Oh. <clears throat> Quest board unlocked. <laughs> Ancient forest to research. Wait, is it post? Post is what, uh, yeah. What you do to find? Yeah, post a quest to, like, go go into the quest menu. Yeah. Okay. No passcode. So, how does the quest work with multiplayer? Um. So once you post it, uh, like. Um, brings up the quest as something that the uh, people in the lobby can join. Mm -hmm. So they go to the quest board and then see if there's any po quest postings, and then they can select the quest to join. Oh, so that's what it means to like post it. Yeah. Oh, it has to be one person. Oh, uh, what what quest is? It guess the Don Kerfuffle. Oh, uh, yeah, it's probably like a one person limit. Uh, okay. Here, I'll try screaming, streaming my screen. Okay. This doesn't like, look very high res to me. Oh, yeah, it's pretty, pretty low res looking. 
Oh yeah, I can watch all of you. All of you stream. Give me a four. Interrupting. <laughs> Give me a four, four window view. Oh. Hey, okay, seems like. Seems oh, it like doesn't. Doing okay. It doesn't play all of the video streams at once. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you can do that. That's bullshit. <laughs> oh. Hold on one sec. I need to carry something in ground view. All right. Yeah. Just uh, depart. Oh, look at that. Did you go try it out? Oh, everyone's streaming. Oh shit. Maybe I should start streaming. Wait, what the? It says sit type. Oh, okay. Am I. No. Am I maxed up? On these? Okay, so you saw, you saw that uh, little icon in the corner of the, those items that you took? Uh, get out of the supply block, and then scroll to the item in your item scroll wheel thing. It's the hold left button, and then X or B to scroll through it. Yeah. So you see that little after oh, yeah. thing thing? That means it's like a different type of item. Like the first aid med is a potion, but it counts as like a separate item in its own stack. And oh, okay. it's also with the asterisk, it means it's like an account item. Which means at the end of the quest, it gets returned or taken out of your inventory. Oh, this one? The Mega Potion? No. No, Mega Potion with oh. the. It's just like a higher quality potion. Okay, so these are just. These ones would get yeah. removed after. Yeah. And there's a few other items that will have the um, asterisk. Basically, it'll say like either uh, have their own name or it'll be like easy something. Just means like it's a supply material and it won't it's not permanent. Okay. Yeah, you just have to follow this guy. And he'll bring you to whatever you need to hunt on this quest. Should I be doing a solo quest? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Go ahead and do your quest, because, uh, the Castadon one is a single player quest, it seems. You guys should, uh, all join the same lobby first, though, I guess. If you got it all unlocked. Uh, I think I unlocked it. Yeah. I think you should be able to join Leo's lobby. Do I have to go back to the title screen? No. Just uh, go to the quest board and then. Oh, telling you about the quest board. Yeah, just. Uh, or you can talk to your handler. Yeah, talk to your handler. Um, online session, yeah. Search for. Or, yeah, friends. Uh, Oh wait, it says players 3 out of 16. Oh, are you guys all in the same you know? I mean, I'm in the same session. Okay. Oh my goodness, you're using mouse and keyboard, Matt? I don't know how you're gonna deal with the uh, new clutch claw mechanic. You might not like it. It's been a while since he's played. Uh. Like, it's a new button that you have to press, but they have, like, a really weird uh, keybind, and I don't know exactly how you're gonna rebind it to make it feel natural. Because it's, like, C plus right-click or something. Weird like that. So that doesn't work very well um, on small guys, eh? Hmm? The, what doesn't? The, the bash and like running up. Yes. Um, you just have to kind of get used to aiming your weapon. Yeah. Because all, 
all of your like uh, directional inputs are manual instead of relying on like a lock-on system where you normally would in, you put in an action game. Put what where? These wedge beetles. Oh yeah. Wait, I don't even remember this being climbable. That was climbable. This? Yeah. Really? I've never used that path <laughs> before. <laughs> Yeah, the, the scout flies never like took me this path. Oh no, if I whiff one of these. Okay. No, you just, to... just press circle. Why does he have an exclamation point? Huh? Oh, oh. never mind. Sure. Oh, yeah, yeah. You have to go behind the table to talk to him. Oh, I have to follow this guy? Yeah, just follow him. He'll take you to the Kestodons. Are I walking beside Cassadons? No, those aren't Cassadons. Oh, those are Apnoth. <laughs> the, the things that the things that you killed were Cassadons. Okay, they were they were on two legs instead of four legs. Oh, I see. Yep. Is this controller locking a mod as well? I don't remember controller the locking or like the snap. When I'm target, when I'm targeting. Oh, no, it's not marked. It's just setting. I remember, it's snapping like Abu. Yeah, snap the target. Oh, like oh snap over there. Large monster. Stone. Curve. Which camp is? They want the ancient one. Mm -hmm. All right, so I should. Right to target something. Uh, yeah. Normally, you wouldn't really need to target the small monsters. You just like go after them and hit them. Oh, I can't. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Gotta dodge. Oops. Uh, just follow the guy, Matt. He'll take you to the Kestodons. Yeah, just keep pressing triangle, Leo, without inputting any direction. Un unless you need to uh, reposition your gear where you're facing. Because yeah, you want to complete your slicing combo. Oh. Yeah, so that's so after the end of that combo where you see that last strike, you can roll out of it to get rid of that end leg. Or yeah, you can re uh, readjust where you're facing to also continue another combo. Yeah, yeah, and then you can roll out of that. Okay. Yeah, you you kind of get it, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. I should also pay attention to you when they're about to <laughs> yeah. do their thing. Okay. Got him. Yeah, the camp site. Didn't the camp site just be the one, like. I went to, the like, forest, or in the, like, the bottom. Bottom tree area. Yeah, jump off! Camp. Jump, jump off that one. Yeah, go straight there. Yeah, jump off. Uh, don't cut. Stop the farm. Stop the farm. <laughs> Wait, okay. It's not single. You have to collect three times. Yeah. Oh, me? Uh, no, 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 not you. I'm talking to the. Yeah, just up there. Up those vines. There you go. Where is the one here? That, that's the one here. No, where's the wedge beetle here? Oh, wedge beetle here? No, because you don't really go up there. You What's usually up? jump off from there. Oh my god, I can't see your face! <laughs> <laughs> the great Jagras. Oh yeah, the great Jagras! Oh man, it's still the like, fucking... through windows. <laughs> Are you going to play some hunting horn? Oh my gosh. Fun. 
secret Jaegers just ate that thing. Rise hunting horn, main. わかりました。新たなターゲットを緊急設定。ドスジャグラスを狩猟してください。準備ができていなかったら、一度拠点に帰ってドスジャグラスのクエストを受注できますよ。Oh, what the heck? How come you had so much text there? I don't know. Menu the base hunter sets are broken. What? The base sets are broken. Are they? Yeah, because they're like with, with, with the mods that we've been using over time. Which mods? I think it might be the one that like, the glamour thing. Because how it used to cheat with, the, with um... How some of the older mods used to cheat with how they did layered armor is they... Oh, did you do you still have that going? Cause I uninstalled all of that stuff. But it's like a external program, anyways, so it shouldn't affect it, right? I don't know, but all the base armor sets have like changed. The... You should um just like uninstall all your mods and then install that mod pack I have on the Google Drive. Cheating! Not cheating. <laughs> Quality of life. Ooh, level up. Level up my footprints. Be like litchy. <laughs> no, it's back end stuff. Change the decoration drop rates because they were kind of ridiculous. And also I make shinies on the ground better looking. Every time I click out of there, the arrow. What's this one three? Hmm? Oh, that's uh. your. Um, weapon helper. It's uh, your max level charge and then the charge that you're on. Hmm. So when you're dash dancing, you can keep track of it. Level? It'll also tell you your uh, Safi armor hit counts or when you get your health regen. Ooh, I gotta go down, eh? Yeah. Up here. That's a pretty long download journey. Yeah, you don't need it right now. Or did you already delete her mods? <laughs> Iron ore. Ooh, National Light Ore, that's what I need for my next Yeah. Level of uh sword and shield. Get the mechabytes. Mm, and then it's Dragon Eye. What the heck? That did not hit me. Wait, I guess I just have to delete my... Oh my gosh. That's swimming. I do not like that. What? Why don't you like swimming? It was just kind of jarring. <laughs> <laughs> like everything's super murky. It's immersive. Oh, hello. Oh, it's a gray Jaguarus. Target camera. Yeah, follow the bugs. I mean, look at your screen. Oh, yeah, you're pretty much at where Leo is. He just got empty. Oops, sorry, Leo Rio. Oh, did you hit him? Didn't mean to. Did you abuse your cat? Wait. Should I be picking up all this stuff? Uh, bone pile. The ammo, ammo, no bone piles, yeah. Because you already have ammo, it'll just swap out whatever you have loaded into your slinger. Yeah, see how it kind of swaps it out? Oh, yeah. How do you change? Uh, what do you mean, change? Um, change the weapon, or the the ammo type? You only have one ever, uh, on you. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, so I that's see. That's an ammo. Well, yeah, I'm so you can only carry out. one type with you, and then if... If you're like running low, you can swap out your ammo with something else that you find. So now that I'm maxed, does it change anything? 
Do I keep looking for footprints and stuff? Yeah, you can keep collecting. There's uh, multiple levels of uh, research. I think it says it in, like, max, though. Oh, okay. You might have to talk to the research guy. I, I forgot how it works exactly. I just... Ernie, the gauges didn't show up during when I was fighting the Kulu. Uh, which gauges? I need the gauges. I need the gauges. The Hunter Pies stuff. It's supposed to be a parser, isn't it? Oh. Oh, uh, you have to turn it on. Isn't it on? Uh, like, go, to, go to your Hunter Pie. Oh. Go, no, yeah, go to your Hunter Pie. No, uh, the, the actual program itself. Oh. Yeah, just all tap to it. Okay. Uh, oh, oh yeah, I, I'll I'll pull up my hunter pie. Just, let's see. Uh, it should be your. Yeah, it's in settings. I think it's the parser or character. No, it's in settings. Um, so just go to your, let's see, damage meter widget. That's in settings. Yeah. Yeah. And then enable damage widget. Uh, you can, streamer mode just lets you show it uh, in OBS. Because it's an overlay, so it won't naturally show. Um, yeah, you can pull out show total damage, show damage per second. Sharp claw. Show only my damage if that's if you want to save space. Show okay. timer is good. Let's finish this quest for me. I have to restart. Yeah. And then you can also get show the graph as well if you want to see damage oh, over time. <clears throat> I see the gate, great Jagras. Running away. Boreto. Yeah. Yeah, those are all the areas you've explored. Get add, gets added to the map. I think it's behind you. Moving away from you. That guy, right? Yeah, the great Jagras. Should I fight him while he's not here? Uh, it's the yellow, yeah. yellow one. Oh. Uh, it's the iguana one. Oh, wait, no, you're supposed to hunt Kulu Yaku, okay. Yeah, yeah. Get, uh, hunt that Kulu Yaku guy. Get him. Oh wait, Rick. I was watching the wrong tree. Watching me. <laughs> yeah. I was like, wait, it's my chest for that show. Yeah. So he's just changing areas right now. I can't attack him? You can attack him. Yeah, I guess he get hits in while he's moving. Uh, this area, while he's moving, will kind of drag you if you get too close to him. Uh, yeah, just keep, keep stabbing away at him. Uh, oh, also you have your uh, clutch claw right now. Remember how to use that? You can I can also not. use that to grab him. 
Uh, so you go into aiming mode with L2 and then press circle to use your clutch claw. And then press triangle. Yeah. So that that allows you to knock out a slinger ammo. So the slinger ammo that you knock out of uh, monsters are uh, a bit stronger than the ones you find in nature. Or on the ground and stuff like that. So this is a piercing pod. It just goes through the monster. It's a damage and it kind of flinches them for a little bit in the hit. Knocked down right now, so go up to his head and start fighting him there because he'll do more damage. It's a good time to capitalize. Yeah, see how much more damage you're doing compared to the back. Yep. Oh, he's not full anymore. Yeah. Okay, so a clutch claw onto him when he does that. Oh, okay. No, oh, it's fine. No more. So when when they kind of rear back like that with the uh, massive amount of drool coming out, it means you can hit, uh, take that chance to clutch claw onto them. And they'll be stunned for a little bit. It's a window for you to use your clutch claw attack. You don't have to remember that for now. You kind of just learn that uh, animation as you play. It's just a side note for now. Don't worry too much about it. Yeah. Alright, gotta chase him. Oh, so uh, you see his icon? You see that skull coming out of him? Yep. So because you have your max stacks of like research points, it means you'll know when he's um, close to death on the mini-map. Oh. Yeah. So at this point, um, he's when he's close to death like that on the mini-map, it means you can capture him if this uh, if this were like a uh, capture quest, or if you have capture materials on you or equipment. Oh boy! White space. I'm a little bit range of clutch claw. Why am I just running? <laughs> I'm back here. Uh, remember that flash fly thing? Yep. Yeah, so go ahead and hit it. Can I hit it? I can hit it with my sword, right? Yep, yep, you can hit it with your sword. So now he's kind of dazed. He'll still do attacks, but um, he won't direct it towards you. So if you're just mindful of where he's looking, you'll be able to do some damage to him. Oh, and you're bouncing now because you went down in sharpness level. So did you notice your weapon deflecting off of the yep. skin? Yeah. So certain parts requires like a requires you to have a certain um, sharpness level to cut through it. Is this capture net? Uh, you don't need it. That's that's for like uh, capturing smaller things, like birds and bugs and that stuff. Not for big monsters. It, yeah, you collect like pets for your room that you can place. It's a side thing. Also. So aim your aim your capture net, or equip it first. You have to equip it because you have your piercing pod equip. It uses the same slot as your slinger ammo. Okay, now aim it at get close to the flash flies. Just ignore these guys, and then shoot your capture net at the flash fly. So you see how you captured it? So yep. now you can put that in your room. When you can customize your room. It's a little fun side thing if you want to collect some pets and stuff like that. <laughs> Stop your farm. Might as well. It's on the way.
Stop, he's already dead. <laughs> you have to put away your weapon. Alright, time to... Oh, should I keep... Yeah, carve them. You went to the trouble of killing them, so... Get your reward. What are you guys doing? Uh, you're on for Puffle? Yeah, you should do that Kestadon thing. Maybe. That's the one I'm doing. What are you doing now? Oh, did I lose my capture net if I picked up stuff? Nope. It's because it takes up the slinger slot, remember? That you, know, and you can only have one thing in there. I would like aggro on something random, but I can't travel back to the camp. Damn it. Go hide in a bush until you're an aggro. So that's a vitality plant. If you break it, you get like a little healing powder. Uh, I think it's. Did you did you select it? No, it's probably working. Just not. Just some things aren't as apparent. Or are fixed. Geometry. No, I don't think they, it affects foliage. Okay, so grab them. Uh, left trigger and circle. Oh, uh, you almost got it. But yeah, you still got your attack off, so that's fine. Nice. You did it. Dead. How is that you? How's the weapon feel? It feels regular. <laughs> There's like a your hack and slash type weapon. Yeah, it's uh it's like a versatile, pretty straightforward weapon with some combo streams in there that you have to kinda mm. purposefully activate, like the perfect Russian back hop thing. Does it still have just the square, triangle, square, triangle, square, triangle? Uh, circle, triangle. Or whatever. Yeah. yeah. It has it's that, but... Uh, you... I guess you can still use that, but it's not as good compared to the uh, perfect rush and the uh, back hop charge slash. Alright, so I've gotten everything, right? Yep. Quest complete. What are those things called again? Those flies? Which one? Oh, oh scout bugs. Scout, or scout bugs. flies. Scout flies. Scout flies, yeah. Yeah, they'll highlight things that you pass by and tell you what, the, what it is. And notify you that there's things near you that you can check out. Having a look at the next... Next monster. Oh, what the yeah, heck? Look at that. I like that. Pew 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 key. Keep it. Yeah. Yeah, it's like a. Okay, boogie. Okay, boogie. It's like a chameleon bird hybrid. Kanari ki na tatte na. Ano konseki wa nanda? Anna no ima made mita koto ga nai zo. What the heck is that wrong? Oh, yeah, Zora. Uh, no, not the village. Only in the oh, gathering hub. Oh, oh. Yep. 
because uh, some of the raids requires more people or sieges. Nah, just take everything. You wouldn't see anyone past the floor. The floor you're with the... No, you you can see them in the lobby. Oh. Oh yeah. yeah. I thought you did in the special. So where are yeah. the bonus? Uh, bonus rewards are from like um, part breaks. So when you were fighting him, I think you broke one of his arms and also his face or something like that. You'll oh. see like a scar or, or a scar or like a kind of broken tooth or something like that. Oh, okay. Yeah. And these are the items gathered by your pal Ku. Monster so, bone by your door. Yeah. Whenever you pass by like a gathering spot in and decided to grab stuff. Yeah, so as, uh, see it's uh, research level one. You can research it two more times, or level it up two more times. Okay. Yeah. Welcome to the new world. Welcome to the jungle. Bigger wasp delivery. Yeah. That's the uh, tools that your palico can use. So I can get give you like the uh, the healing bigger wasp. And it'll heal you from time to time if you need it. Oh, I have to like unlock the. Yeah, you have to unlock all those oh. tools and stuff. Look at that nose. What nose? Oh, you're looking the at Leo's nose. stream. <laughs> <laughs> it's a beautiful nose. It's a beautiful schnoz. It's worthy of the name Schnoz.